Hi guys, my name is Pina James Cole and welcome to episode 2 of Sims for a Black Widow, Widow Challenge. Mm -hmm. Imagine this where we left her in the first hey. episode in the bar. Unfortunately, last episode didn't go very well in the sense that we kind of wanted to try and hook up with somebody, but we just could not find any single men anywhere. Somebody commented um, on the previous episode that I think it was Dominic that I was talking about because Dominic was married and somebody said that you can go for married men and you can convince them to leave their spouse. I don't know whether that's something that we maybe want to do. This bartender is terrible. She just keeps dropping the bars. Yeah, I don't know whether that's something we maybe want to do. Let me know down in the comments. Here's uh, most men. The thing is, if they're married and they come and live with us, they won't bring their money with us with them because they are. it's not the whole household leaving. I don't know, let me know down in the comments kind of what the deal is with all of that and what you think. But I think we should probably go home. It's 2 o'clock in the morning. In fact, we should definitely go home. Let's go home. She's eating some chips. Right, back at home. Let's go for a sleep. I don't think she's slept in this house yet. This can be her bed. Sleep. Claim this one and sleep. That's the only double bed, I think. Yeah, that's the only double bed. She can have a little sleep because she's quite tired she's been out all night trying to find a man with no success so i think we'll probably let her have a little sleep fulfill her needs slightly and then we'll go out again and try and find someone okay she's grown up she's just toileting and showering and then oh hang on we've got the um oh, she was going to cook something but she's got this uh how long four left of the fruit cake from the welcome wagon that came so she may as well, in fact, has somebody left some on the floor? Somebody's left some on the floor. That's awful. She might as well eat that, get her, um, get the use out of it. So in terms of money, we're okay for money. We've got like three grand at the moment, but we can't get a job. If you're unfamiliar with the rules of Black Widow, we're not able to get a job. The money that we get must come from like the husbands that we, the people that we marry, and we've got to try and like take them for all their things. Oh, who says Hugo? We'd love to have you in Upper Crust. Should we join a club? Um, I mean, let's join a club. Yeah, why not? Nice. Uh, welcome to Upper Crust, Clara. Okay. Um, we're having a club gathering. Welcome to Upper Crust. I'm happy that you decided to join our club. We're having a club gathering, and we'd love for you to introduce yourself to the group. We're all going to meet at the lighthouse. I mean, should we go? There may be single dudes over there. We never know. Is this a this is a house? I thought that maybe okay, there's two women. And there's Hugo. Oh, is it Hugo Villarreal? Oh and he's only a teen. This is no good. Uh let's just praise the cross leader. This is a nice house. This is no use for what we need to do. I thought maybe there would be more people around. There's not. We're going to leave this gathering, I'm afraid. I want to live in this house. Whoa, it's even got, like, got a bees in the garden. It's so nice. Look at the pool area. Wow, right, I'm getting sidetracked. Right, let's leave because we don't want to be here. There is no one here to chat to. This is a nice lounge. Right, let's go, let's go before I get to, um, let's travel. Let's see. Anybody at the pool? Anyone around anywhere? This is a nice area. I like it here. Should we invite someone? That guy that we were talking to last time. Invite to hang out with current lot. Let's. Sergio Romeo. What about. Well, he had a girlfriend, didn't he? But I quite like the look of him. What about Caden Queen? Let's invite him over. In fact, let's invite both of those two over. See what they're doing. And we can chat to one of those. Hopefully one of them can come over. Everyone is coming over. Excellent. Oh, here we go. Here's, um, here's the guy we were chatting to last time, Sergio. Let's ask about his group. Let's get to know him a little bit. Let's what's our relationship like with him? Have a little look in a second. And, oh, here's that's the other dude. I'm not so, not as keen as him on him as I am on Sergio. I like him. And these about oh, ask if single. We've already asked him that, but 
um, gossip, <laughs> heartfelt compliments. Sergio is a tech guru at Rainy Day Entertainment. Okay. Uh, let's ask him about his day. Should we try flirting or should we just do some friendly things for now? Who is he seeing? I don't want to know who he's seeing. I don't want to know. Why not, like, ask about girlfriend or boyfriend? I mean, if, it's, if he's got a boyfriend, maybe that's time that we should move on to somebody else. Who's this guy here? Hang on. Jeffrey. Let's have a little look at Jeffrey. I have a feeling that Jeffrey is... We know Jeffrey already, don't we? Is he married? How do we find this stuff out? I'm so... Oh, just hover over him. Uh, oh, he's he's married. So, I think I have more chance of splitting up like a boyfriend and girlfriend than I have of splitting up a marriage. <laughs> so, maybe we just uh, chat to him. Let's flirt with him. See how see how it goes. Flirting. He really doesn't like it, or oh oh, did he like the flirting? Ah, he likes the flirting. Okay. Imagine is materialistic. Materialistic sims need to buy new things and enjoy themselves. Right, okay. He likes the flirting, so... Oh, Sergio hates children. Let's try a pickup line. Maybe I'm going too fast here, but... Let's compliment his ex appearance. Oh, he's liking this. Imogen has reached charisma level 3. He's liking the um He's liking the flirting. I don't think I think he might be easily persuaded to leave his girlfriend. Do a little sexy pose. Let's let's try and exchange numbers. I tried to exchange numbers when we saw him in the pub last episode and he wasn't interested. He's interested now though. Definitely. Um let's flirt. This is going well. This is going well. Let's blow him a kiss. Should we ask him on a date? Let's confess attraction and see how he feels about about that. Hopefully his girlfriend doesn't rock up. Um, first kiss. Oh, I don't know. Um, ask about love life. Invite to stay the night. Mm, maybe not quite yet. Let's. <laughs> Hang on, what can we see? Um, compliment appearance. I thought you might tell us something about his, um, like who he was dating or whatever when we asked about love life, but he didn't. Um, ask a risky question. See if he likes that. Should we try for first kiss? Let's try for first kiss and see what happens. I think that he might go for it. Bit of a dare bag though, like if he's got a girlfriend, but <gasps> they are having their first kiss. Oh, he looks very shocked. <laughs> oh, this could be the potential first husband. Okay, let's ask to be boyfriend. Is that a bit soon? Let's, let's embrace and uh, try for a baby. We don't want babies. Um, should we go and woohoo? <laughs> Let's just be friendly for a second. Brighten his day. Um, should we ask him to be boyfriend? See what he says? Or compliment his appearance again. He seems to like it when we compliment his appearance. And let's flirt. And then I'm going to go for... I'm going to go for ask to be boyfriend. Let's just go for it. See what he reckons. <gasps> she said yes. Oh my goodness, we have our first boyfriend. Yes. Okay. Should we? Let's not profess our undying love. It's a bit, a bit soon. Be enticing, and we'll offer. We'll ask him to stay the night. I think. Let's do a passionate kiss. Oh, she's. Ang oh, is that the girlfriend? Maybe that's the girlfriend. Whoa. I think. I think that was the girlfriend that came along and. But we're stamping in the background there. Oops, sorry. Okay, let's... Should we just do a passionate kiss? Let's invite to stay the night and see what he thinks to that. 
<laughs> Hopefully. You will. You should do. Well, it's all moving quite fast, isn't it? The sleepover it sounds great. How does that happen then? Do we just go home now or... Okay, let's go home. Will he come with us when we go home? I don't think I've ever invited to stay the night before. Let's see what happens. Okay, we are back at home, but no, he didn't come with us. Let's, um... Let's phone him up and invite him round. Hang on, let's, should we get changed out of our bikini? Maybe that was the whole thing that did it for us, the bikini. Let's change into, ooh, nude? No, let's go everyday two. I can't remember what the everyday two outfit was. Oh, I don't really like that look, actually. But I don't like that look at all. Why did I design that look? I'm going to change it. Um, but for now, I'm going to go, let's do party one. What's party one? That's nice. Not particularly party, but it's nice. Oh, he's coming in. Right, okay. Hang on. Hope he doesn't mind our very bare, minimalistic -y type of house. Oh, he's coming cleaning up for us. He's going to be the perfect husband. We're going to marry him, break his heart. It's going to be terrible. Right, invite to stay the night. Let's see. Oh, is it because we did a community lot? We shouldn't do that a community lot. Invite to stay the night. Hi, hey, Arv. How are you doing? Gablanoosh. Invite right, to stay the night. Yes, he is going to sleep. Right. He's tired. Hang on. Not yet. Uh, romance. Express our fondness and let's woohoo. Moving very fast. I was sure that last episode he was not going to be interested in us, but yep, he is absolutely interested in us. Go and woohoo. Break out the candles, make it romantic. Imogen is about to woohoo for the first time. There we go, got our first boyfriend, first woohoo. It's been successful. It has been successful. Right, let's have a little look. Is she hungry? She's hungry. He's shattered, straight to sleep, typical bloke. <laughs> um, let's take a piece of that. We should probably put it away as well. Oh, she's a little bit hungry. Have a little snack. And then go to sleep. Uh, oh. We were in a bush. Whisper. Oh. Make out. Yes. Don't go home yet. Oh yes. <laughs> oh yes. He's he's pleased with his night. Uncomfortable. Oh, is it an uncomfortable bed? Yeah, yeah. Hang on. Let's romance. It's gone. Whatever I. Had before, should we propose? Is that a bit soon? Let's woohoo again. Have a quick woohoo, and then should we just go and propose? Let's. Yeah. It's a quick, steamy love affair this has been. <laughs> but if he's going to say yeah, it'd be perfect. I wonder if he's got any money. That's the thing. I kind of feel sorry for him. I like him. And we're just going to... He's gonna hurt him. We're gonna break his heart. No, 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 no. Oh, he's going. Ah. Oh. Okay, I mean, we'll leave him. We won't propose. He wants to go. That's fine. We will leave him. We'll go and take a piece of fruit cake. We got a boyfriend. Excellent. I am very pleased with today's episode. I think next episode, we're gonna go ahead and propose to him straight off and try and get married in next episode. And then we can start the process of breaking his heart. It's terrible. Imogen is a... I was going to say a naughty word then. She's not a nice lady. Not a nice lady at all. But thank you so much for watching episode two, guys. Thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. I will see you guys soon ah, for a new video. Thanks for watching. Bye. Mm -hmm.